attitude indicator is the most important instrument in the aircraft for flight in reference solely to instruments and is of great benefit in VFR maneuvering when you know how to use it. This instrument is the only instrument that can show pitch and bank information simultaneously without the lag that other instruments have. This video is not intended to show you how to use this instrument, but simply to show you how it operates. We learned the basics of this instrument during our private pilot training, but seeing the actual parts and observing it in operation is always beneficial to the understanding of how any instrument works. The attitude indicator can be run by vacuum, pressure, DC electric or AC electric. This particular attitude indicator is a vacuum driven instrument. Filtered air is drawn into the instrument to spin the gyro up to 18,000 RPM and runs through the instrument in line with the directional gyro in many airplanes. Positive pressure air is introduced through this port, travels along this arm of the gimbal, and is introduced to the gyro through these jets. The air is then exhausted out of these holes and then out of the gyro assembly behind the pendulous vanes. The instrument is balanced in every axis in order to maintain stability. As the gyroscope spins, the tendency is to maintain its attitude and consequently provides, through mechanical linkage, the aircraft attitude for the pilot. The pendulous vanes serve to counteract gyroscopic precession. The vanes will open as the gyro precesses and the pressurized air corrects for that precession. Note that excessive pitch angles and forces will cause the instrument to tumble. When this happens, it will take several minutes for the attitude indicator to right itself.